Swimming Pool Steve here with another equipment installation review. Let's go ahead and get started with this one. <laughs> okay, so that close pipe there is our suction line. So we've got a poly pipe out of the ground, uh, a couple of uh, uh, pipe clamps there into a uh, spigot by slip connector into a street elbow. I would have much preferred to see a sweep elbow here. No reason to have a street elbow, like always. Um, one thing I can say here is that's a nice long straight run into the pump. This union is actually a fair, unions and valves are a fairly significant flow restriction. So given that you had all of the room in the world to work with here, I probably would have put that union a little bit further up here, uh, maybe even right near that elbow there. Um, it's okay, nothing wrong with it, nice straight run, but uh, if it were my pool, I probably would have installed that a little further over. Uh, so out of the pump, we've got uh, the sets, oh, okay, temperature probe right there. So out of the pump, into the filter, good filter pressure there. Uh, out of the filter, again, a bunch of unions for access, that's nice. Uh, we've got a two inch coupling that's been bushed down to inch and a half on one side and a two inch uh, street elbow on the other. Um, again, I would have preferred to see a sweep elbow there. Uh, and we go down into the heater, back out of the heater, down, and into this chlorinator cell with the flow switch. So if you've seen my other videos, you know already what's wrong here. There's no check valve in between this chlorinator and the heater. And this is a pretty decent heater here. It doesn't look that old. Um, you'd certainly want to protect it, and I, or at least I would if it, if it were mine. So I would absolutely have a check valve in there uh, to prevent this chlorine from tracking backwards into the heater and causing damage. Uh, normally when I, I don't see that check valve, I also don't see bonding on the heater, but this heater is in fact bonded, as is the pump as well down there. So that's nice to see. They've got the bonding done, uh, but I, you know, it, it's, there's no reason to not have a check valve. Uh, I think they're probably around $50 or so. If you can install it yourself, or probably around 80 if you have a service company come out. It's worth mentioning here that this entire system is plumbed in an inch and a half, except for this section right here. So I'm just guessing that the uh, the installer didn't have any more inch and a half with them when they installed that. That's probably just why that two inches there. There would be no reason to have two inch for there. Either you would have the whole pad in two inch, or essentially nothing. There's not really any point in it having just a one small section of the pad being two inch and the rest an inch and a half. Uh, this, this pool in particular is controlled by a Hayward Pro Logic system. Uh, so you've got all your breakers here for the components, the pump, filter, heater, or sorry, pump and heater, probably landscaping lights, things like that as well. Uh, these units are actually really nice. If, you, uh, if you're looking to automate your system, then uh, something like that would definitely uh, be what you're looking for. Uh, Pentair, of course, and Jandy have similar uh, style heaters, actually, or similar style control panels. In fact, Hayward this year, uh, 2015, came out with the Omni Logic. It's uh, it's it's just uh, gigantic. It's like you can see the size of that control panel. It's easily twice the size of that. Uh, they're ridiculously large, but they look pretty fancy. So if you're looking for a high-end control panel, check out the uh, the Hayward Omni Logic one. Um, and that's just about it here. Everything else looks pretty good. It's a fairly clean setup here. Um, you know, just a little bit to the spaghetti with the wiring here. I'd like to see that cleaned up a bit. Um, again, the check valve installed in between the, the salt cell and the heater. But other than that, it looks pretty darn good here.